Cowboy leads a different kind of life when there were cowboys. They're a dying breed. Uh, we sure are. Nothing like being a cowboy. And in Wickenburg, you have an authentic Wild West experience. The town, home to a dude ranch spanning about 20,000 acres. And every day, the horses kick up the dust out there. So let's check back in with Gina and Javier. I say it's time to saddle up, partner. Oh, they're doing good. It's perfect. Yeah, I'm going to take my horse to the old town <laughs> road. I'm going to ride till I can no more. I'm going to take my horse to the old town road i'm gonna ride till i can't no more can't nobody tell me nothing <laughs> good morning arizona this is the beautiful shot from rancho de las caballeros That's right and rusty grant you've been here for 35 years, 35 is what that's what we're telling everybody. You are one of the original owners, and we're so glad that you're uh, joining us. And we've got to turn the camera to your horse run because it's such an amazing sight that I don't want to waste any more time. I want everybody at home to see what we are looking at. What is this, Rusty? These are uh, horses that we use for the guests to take on rides, and there are about 80 of them here, 80 of them here, and they're going from the, from the nice pasture to the corrals. That's right. And you're going to see them uh, shortly down there. So, yeah. So this is a morning run. Yeah. Every morning guests yeah. who are out here get to see this. Right. Right. And we, we take them back in the, in the afternoon as well. So. And you, you said there's actually a significance because you want to get them from point A to yeah. point B so that they can eat. Yeah, they're, they're oh, look at that. Beautiful. These are just stunning, majestic animals. I bet after all these years, Rusty, this doesn't get old. It doesn't. It doesn't. It, 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 it. It's always fun. Tell us a little bit about the history, because this ranch was actually passed down to you, but you grew up on this ranch. Uh, Dad and two other guys built the place in the late 40s. We opened in uh, just December of 48. Of course, I was raised uh, uh, on, on the ranch. I guess I'm a, a little warped. <laughs> you look good, my friend. But it's, it's not bad, and it's a, a really good life side. Uh, like I said, a lot of things you never get tired of seeing. And uh, we're glad to have Colonel Tree and you guys to, to show it to us to you and uh, share it with you. Rusty, sure. is there a favorite out here? Oh, one of the horses? Yes. Uh, I like them all. Yeah. Well, it, it, naming one would be like trying to name a favorite kid, right? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. you can't do that. Exactly. What I love your explanation about the place, you said uh, people ask you often, is this a ranch? Is this a resort? And you say... We always say, well, what do you want it to be? <laughs> <laughs> we can do both. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yes is all. the answer. So, Right. What do you want guests to take away most importantly when they stay here? You know, I hope uh, we have good weather so they can see the desert in Arizona at its finest. I mean, this is a nice, great shape, which you know, and we like to see everybody else uh, around the country to see that, and hopefully they can stay, stay with us when they do it. It's just neat. And, uh, Rusty, you know, you were telling me that uh, folks come from all over the world, but right. we'd like to see more people come from Phoenix up here. Oh, boy, I would. I mean, uh, <laughs> we're only about, you know, about an hour from Phoenix, and it's a nice break. And as you can see, everything's a little bit different here than it is in Phoenix. We're uh, a, thousand, a thousand feet higher than Phoenix. So it's a little cooler. Yeah, a little, well, in the summertime. Uh -huh. <laughs> we say it's uh, 10 degrees in the summertime and only two in the winter. All righty. Well, you know what, Rusty? Um, you're a true Arizona cowboy. Well, well I don't know I, about that. I, I, want, I want you to evaluate this this <laughs> outfit here. City yeah, is it Does he pass as an Arizona cowboy or just a, a wannabe? Uh, no, I think he looks very good. I, you know, I, don't, know the, I don't know if the cowboys would uh, put the, your shirt in or not. <laughs> that, whatever he does, he looks great. <laughs> there you go. You just got the thumbs up from the real deal. That's it. I'm official. So we're going to send it back to you, Scotty. All right. Rusty, if thank I got you it, so much. The thank official uh, stamp of approval from a real cowboy by Rusty. What do you think, cowboy? Uh, man, I, Rusty, he's the real deal. I'm sitting back here listening to Olivia and Yetta talk about how scared they are of horses. Uh, but I, when those horses went by, I love the pain horses. I always wanted a pain horse. So those are cool. <laughs> oh, those are beautiful, the paint horses. Yeah, they are. Yeah. 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 You guys right, look buddy, good out more, there. More coming up in a little bit. All right. Thank you, guys. Thank you, cowboy.
quero 